Welcome back to Metro Exodus. We have a few more things to check out on this island, all these icons to the east of us. I want to do that before I do the main thing, which is the big icon on the bottom left, which is where I would go if I wanted to initiate Miller's rather extreme plan. I'm not even sure what the plan is, to be honest, but it involves getting through the gate slash bridge, which I believe is barricaded. Yeah, perfect. Okay, let's go to the first one up here. There's a lot of those small things screaming down there. Hopefully they'll ignore me. Especially if I Especially if I stay up here. Okay, it's going back. Question mark seems to be that field of... Oh, it's the field of holes. Alright. Okay. Oh, I'm out of ammo. Uh, I think we're good for a second. I can craft some more. Yeah, I've got plenty of materials to make more. Let's get like 40. I think it's just on the other side of the tracks. Oh, Jesus. That scared him away. Good. Gotta remember they can come out of any hole they want, though. So they can just go into a hole and pop up behind me. Sturdy envelope. Brother Peter, you'll have to abandon your holy quest to bring your party back. A new group of heathens has appeared at our very gate, and there are reasons to believe that they may be far more dangerous for us than our usual assailants, as these seem to not just... These seem to not just... Wait, as... Grammar and this one's weird. <laughs> these seem as not just able to prey on our blood and fruit of our toil, but quite capable of assaulting and destroying the very foundations of our faith. Your demon fighters will have to return to the bridge and keep their vigil until it's time to bring the mailed fist of our Lord's judgment upon the heads of the heretics. Salantius. It's a lot of demons around there. Oh, I think there's bandits too. And monsters? What are those? Yeah, the zombie-like things. A lot of bills up there. That's the bridge that we need to get through. Oh, there's something out here. Yeah, a little... little island. Well, I need a boat. 
Probably. I might be able to just jump over there and get far enough that it will auto take me there. Okay. Radiation super high. Whoops. But there also is probably a boat pretty close, right? Yeah, they're very weak if you hit them in the front, where they have no armor. I'm gonna try jumping. If I jump really far, I might be close enough to the other side that it will just, you know, have me pull up over there. Uh, I doubt it. Wait, did that work? <laughs> no. Alright, some other time when I find a boat. Oh, they're still praying over there. Well, being daylight, stealth is not really going to work, so I guess I might as well just try to start sniping them? Test out the sniper for real? I mean, I could try to be at least a little bit stealthy, right? Uh, let me craft a couple cans, too, for distractions. Why is everybody laughing? There's an awful lot of them around here. It's gonna be so easy to get spotted. I just want to double check. I can't put a silencer on a revolver, right? I don't have one. Wait. Do you have a suppressor? But I thought I didn't. Uh, maybe I've gained one just in the past little bit, but I remember I was at the table, back at the train, and I didn't have a suppressor. Alright, well, anyway. Um, that vastly reduces the damage, takes down the accuracy a bit, so that sucks, but probably worth it. Is that the person I just shot? Are they alive? Oh, come on. Oh my god! Die! I don't think anyone else noticed, amazingly. Thankfully that one didn't cry out. Oh, someone found a body. There's many more. Okay. Whoa. 
Okay. One shot kill. I felt like a shotgun blast. I'm amazed it had such a tight uh, grouping from that range. Okay, that was actually working pretty well. Uh. Alright, well that was terrible. <laughs> okay, this is the one. If this goes wrong, I'm just going to continue. Damn the accuracy. Okay, yep. They heard the scream. I want to go knock him out. How do I get up there? I guess I could just climb. Maybe there is no ladder. Huh. It seemed like you were supposed to climb this. Yeah, there we go. Hi. Okay, I'm getting off this roof. Guess they heard the shots. through ammo so fast. Like, I think when I set out, I had at least a couple magazines of assault rifle ammo, and now just taking out one small bandit camp. Now I'm almost out. Oh, they got a bunch of knives in there, I think. No real need to get in that door, I suppose. You can just go in through the window.
Oh, it's a new type of vest. Right. They mentioned a boat. It said, like, did you put out the boat or bring in the boat or something like that? And they said they did. So there should be one nearby. There's a place to sleep over here. That might have a boat. Yeah, that's the one I took into that factory. Alright, I'm gonna have to deal with those things. Let me make some more ammo for this. Probably make it med kit too, huh? Yeah. Oh. You know, I was kind of hoping the boat would just like respawn back here after I used it. It doesn't. Um. Yeah. That boat's either somewhere inside of that factory, or it might have actually been destroyed during a cutscene when the big fish was flopping around. Either way, I don't think I'm getting it back. We'll have to find another one. Let's go rest and get my health back. Check out the new vest, too. And mix more ammo for the assault rifle. craft one of those. We have so much pistol ammo. Got all that stuff. I badly need to clean these things. Okay, so just a little bit ago we had the carrier vest, then I switched to the ammo pouches, which I just got in the last episode, I think. Throwing weapon harness. Additional straps and pockets for throwing weapons, allowing the wearer to double their stocks. Okay. So it's specialized like that. Like, this is just for giving you more ammunition storage. This is just for giving you more throwing weapons. I mean, I don't feel like I need a huge amount of throwing weapons. I think I'm fine. Not that I need ammo, either. Like, I don't think I've ever hit the limit so far. Even with just the carrier vest, not even with the ammo pouches vest. What? What did I just gain things? It's odd. Did it just like ditch some of my ammunition because I couldn't fit it when I switched? What happened? Did it ditch some of my handgun ammo? I'm not really sure what happened there. Anyway, I'm fine with what I've got. Two question marks north, although they're kind of dangerously close to the bridge. I'm worried about what might happen if I get that close. I don't want to alert them to my presence. 
the caravan or whoever it is that's over there. Eh, let's go do it. I kind of want to scout that place out anyway. Hi. Damn, <laughs> that went really well. Let's see if I can get all my knives back. Oh, oh, there's a lot of radiation. I start with four or five? I think five. I think I'm missing one. The one that I missed when I threw it at somebody. I don't remember who I threw it at. It's probably in the water somewhere. I want it back. Okay, I'm gonna leave it. I'm close to death. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go back and rest to get my health back. Let's go ahead and rest till morning, actually. Even though it already is day. I just want to see if maybe spending a day here will make the boat come back. Look at him go all over the place. So beautiful. Should probably make another filter too. I'm super low on filters. Yeah, one second left. <laughs> um, let's make another one. God, it takes so much chemicals. I even have that extended mask too. I don't know how much it extended the filters by, but it should help somewhat. Boat is not back. Fair enough. Alright, we got another question mark this way. Damn! What made that noise? Oh, it's the doors. They have physics. That's really cool. Oh shit, hi. Uh... I... Should run past them. This is the thing, this vehicle. It's a home. Whoops. Torn page. Although during the moments of clarity he kept his mouth shut for the most time, when his fever would relapse he would ramble, and his ramblings terrified us. The stranger from the south was not coherent, but the picture his disjoint words painted was that of hell on earth. The burning sea, oil spurting from the ground and engulfing man and beast alike in fire. Battles lost and people subjugated by the amorphous menace he only referred to as the Horde. And engines. Engines all the time. 
This man had suffered in life from the god-awful contraptions and electricity far more than we could ever imagine, and probably had atoned for all of his sins by that suffering alone. But after his death, we carried out the rite as if he were one of the faithful, and Sorrowfish took his soul straight to the kingdom of our lord. Yes, that's it for question marks. There's probably some stuff I've missed marking, though. I mean, we do have that one little island out there, of course. Still need to find a boat. And the thing is, like, look to the uh, very top left of the map. See all those little islands? Kind of like north of the church place? The cult place? According to the map, there's nothing in the way of getting to them. So if I can take just take a boat out there... There's got to be something on those, right? They're pretty big pieces of land. I want to get somewhere high and scout again. Don't approach the bridge. Yeah, I figured I shouldn't. Oh, there's watchers. I don't actually see anybody. things I've missed. Well, for now, I'm going to try to find a boat to get to that island. Well, I found a boat just on the other side of these train tracks that go through the water. Pretty sure I can't cross this, but maybe? Nope. Yeah, there's ground right there, just a little bit under the water. Aha! Uh -huh. I found a boat! Oh! Okay. Well, that was a hell of a jump scare. It's kind of peaceful when you're out in the water, when nothing's attacking you. Yeah, this is the place. Oh. They're sleeping. Right, it's the... Uh-oh.
Jesus. That's not what I meant to press. bit too close for comfort. I have no medkits left. I can craft more, I'm sure. Pretty poorly handled overall. <laughs> but I'm here. Bandit's note. Brother, I totally understand your lack of confidence, but he was telling the truth. I got the information from him personally. You know what I mean. X is where they hid all the good stuff they were carrying to the terminal. No doubt about that. We have to move quick if we want that loot. I know you'll need to take Luzga on board to help you, and as a respectable man, I agree to an even three-way split. You will do all the footwork, yes, but I have given you the map, my gun, and will also keep the rest of the boys busy with the game while you dig. X is where they hid all the good stuff. I think something's been scribbled on our map. Maybe? I don't see anything. Hmm. Maybe there's some things that don't show up on the map. You're just supposed to figure it out from the texts. X is where they had all the stuff on the way to the terminal. Where is there an X on the way to the terminal? There's one where the tracks meet. But I've already been there. I mean, there's a building there that I've been to little place next to it that I've apparently been to. Huh. I mean, it's possible I've already found whatever they were referring to. Well, I think for now it's time to go back on the main quest. I don't think the next step I'm going to take, meeting the caravan at the port down south, down there, I don't think that's going to just, like, take me away from the map without it being more explicit about, hey, we're leaving. So that, that should be fine. There is some other stuff I definitely want to check out, but we'll get to that later. Let's get ready for the next mission, then. Uh, just recreated this uh, collage just to clean it a bit, but of course putting on the attachments that I was using before, a lot of that is dirty, so I still gotta get it going a bit better. Got a reflex sight, the most damaging barrel, which is very, very loud, biggest magazine, all that stuff, because I'm not going to be using this for my sniper, so I don't need a 4x scope or to worry too much about accuracy. I'm just going to leave this the way it is, because it is a great sniper. Super accurate. This needs to be cleaned. Oh, I need chemicals so bad. I have, like, no chemicals. Well, hmm. I can't even craft a single mech kit. Uh, hmm. I can make a lot of steel balls. So that's something. I'm doing pretty good on ammunition anyway. Yeah, all looks good. Okay. Well, I think this is a pretty good place to end the episode, so I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when I return, we are going to head down there to take on the caravan.